Weasel Stop is not too bad, but also not amazing. This is a Warner Brothers cartoon from 1956, directed by Robert McKimson and written by Ted Pierce. And in the role that barnyard dog usually plays, we have this shaggy dog. And I have to say, I quite like the design of the dog. He's got a really fun animation style. He's got a really good personality style as well. I really liked it, particularly when he was kind of just muttering away to himself about whatever food and different things. So as a character, I really liked him. And when the weasel comes along, Foghorn Leghorn does what he always does and try to get him a real eating chicken and points him in the direction of, of this dog and, and other things and, and basically tries to just make sure that the weasel doesn't get him at the expense of everybody else. And it's a basic concept that we see a lot with Foghorn Leghorn and often it works, but in this one I just felt like it didn't really offer anything too interesting because we have this different character of the shaggy dog there is something that's a little bit different, but whenever we're not looking at the shaggy dog and it's just the weasel and foghorn leghorn, I feel like it's lacking in something. It's not that interesting, but again, it's not it's not bad, it's not boring, it's not badly animated, the pacing's fine. If this had been the first ever foghorn leghorn and weasel cartoon I'd seen, I wouldn't be sitting here going, it's the same as a lot of them, it doesn't offer anything fresh. So in a way, is it fair to judge it against the others? I'd say it is. But with this one, it's just kind of repetitive and not that interesting. Not a lot happens. It's very much driven by the character of the shaggy dog and also the character of the weasel, who I think is just so slimy and eerie and his little facial expressions are so creepy, but in a really satisfying way. So there were bits about it that worked. The animation quality is very good. The characters of the shaggy dog, the shaggy dog in particular, but also the weasel, I absolutely didn't mind but beyond that I didn't mind watching it I didn't get to the end of it and think well that was a, a colossal waste of six minutes but at the same time I probably wouldn't watch it again I'd recommend it if you're a fan of Foghorn Leghorn and you've yet to see Weasel Stop but otherwise I wouldn't say it's anything special